Hi and welcome back to Greenmark Builders TV. Today we're talking about tiling. The first step is your subfloor. When you look here, you can see that we've got one, two, three, four, five plies. So what does that mean? Our floors are kick butt strong. So let's talk about the tools. On this floor, we've got an 18 by 18 tile which requires a half inch by half inch notch trowel. The reason you use a notch trowel is because when you spread your cement, you're getting a perfect half inch height. So one of my rules is keep your site clean. So that's where these tools come in handy. We have a brush to always be keeping the dry material away from your work site and a sponge with water to wash off any excess thin set. So you don't have to sit there and scrub and cut later. So Todd here is mixing up ultralight mortar. The reason it's ultralight is you can put it on your walls and it doesn't fall off when you trowel it. Mix her up there, Todd. <laughs> so here's an example of the ultralight thin set. As you can see, it's holding my trowel in place. So what I always say is the bigger the tile, the bigger the trowel. So as you can see, we're using the half inch trowel again. This is the ultralight mud, sticks to the wall nice, doesn't fall off. So I smooth it out, stand your trowel up, and start moving it around. So once we put our spacers in, we're using a 1 8 grout joint. You place them in, take your tile, set it on your spacer, Put it in. So check this out. This is a Sigma scoring saw with a diamond tip blade. Pull it in to your proper width, do your score, and then it breaks. No dust, no mess. So what we're doing right now is we're back buttering this tile because when you're coming up against the transition, you have to make sure your height works out perfectly. If you just lay your tile down, you might have to pull it up and build it up again later. So thanks Jacques, appreciate you showing us how to do that. Make sure when you got a tiler, he's gotta have a mustache. They're always the best. So after the tile's laid, the guys come along and clean out the joints to get it ready for grout. So Todd's laying the top tiles right now. He's just getting it into place. These tiles don't have a tapered edge, so you have to make sure that they're perfect. So then you don't feel any rough edges. Todd doesn't have a mustache, but he's pretty cool. You know how at Greenmark we take everything to the next level? Well, doing our tile is another example of that. The guys here at Scapolati Flooring have been here for, Jacques, how long you been? 29 years. Mario's been 15 and Todd's been 12. These guys are the real deal. If you want tile done right the first time, give these guys a call. So let's recap. Prep with the proper subfloor. Keep your areas clean. Use the proper trowel. Remember what I say, the bigger the tile, the bigger the trowel. Keep your spacing consistent. And please, if you're gonna get serious about tiling at all, you have to grow a mustache. I'm Mark from Greenmark Builders. Follow me on Twitter, subscribe, and we'll see you next time on Greenmark Builders TV.